My name is Anna Camero. I go to the Yale School of Management. Our club is called Out of Office, and I'm one of the co-leaders. And my name is Billy Marks. I am a second year MBA student at the Yale School of Management. Our club, Out of Office, has about 40 really active members, and then we have lots of allies who are also part of the club. We have a really motivated mission. Our goal is to every year build the LGBT community and build allyship within the broader Yale SOM community. So what I'm really proud of is that this year we've made great gains in growing our internal community. We've had a retreat, we've had lots of informal get-togethers, but we've also been focused on building career capacity in our members and in teaching our fellow classmates what it means to be an ally. And so we have a great marquee event, for example, called Straight But Not Narrow, and that event presents skits that show workplace situations and help people understand, okay, when I become the manager I'm going to be, how can I really show I'm an ally for LGBTQ individuals? Another thing that is a big priority for out of office this year is working with the other community groups on campus. Um, SOM is like a crazy diverse place. I mean, 50% of the students in our class are from out overseas. Um, and then the amount of diversity we have just with the United States population is also kind of pretty crazy. And so there's a lot of different groups on campus that have affinities or ethnicities. And so we're trying to think more about intersectionality and kind of intersectionality of identity. And so we're working with um, the Black Business Association, the Latino and Hispanic Association, and um, as well as the Women in Management group to have, and even best with that group, to have a variety of kind of panels and discussions to kind of talk about what does it mean to exist in both of these communities? What are the challenges that that faces? And I think it really speaks to the diversity and kind of interests of the student body to kind of really dig deep into those kind of complex identities. I think people should come to SOM because there's a global emphasis that's really embedded in the students themselves. Um, we do have that 50% of the school that's international, but we also have a really diverse set of career experiences that people were involved in before they came to SOM and that they're looking to get involved in when they leave. And that, to me, makes the classroom experience so much richer and it makes uh, your learning outside the classroom richer as well. One thing that I I did a little bit, and actually I've had other students that are prospective students that are interested in SM do with me as a, as a out, of, uh, out of office is ask about ally culture. And specifically as an LGBT student, ask straight allies that you're talking to that are not a part of the club what it's like to be out in the school like, what, and how are you exposed to the club. Because I think seeing from the allies' perspective or, or kind of a straight cisgender person's perspective about what the student experience is like will give, uh, give the student a lot of understanding of what it means to kind of exist in that space as an out student throughout their kind of two years of the MBA program.